Feel good to be back last week and uh, help your team earn a win. I feel great. I feel great. You know, the feeling is unbelievable. I'm glad to be back. You had a little bit of a difficulty too with Don Terry out there on the field. I know the concerned big brother and you goes out there. What's that moment like though when you, you, you see him out there and maybe not moving a little bit? Just a real big uh, big brother moment. Just to make sure he's all right. I, you know, I told him I said I don't like to see him hurt anything like that. I mean, it's vice versa. So I had to just check on him. You obviously didn't get to play the last couple of games when he was kind of having his breakout. What was it like, you know, just getting on the field with him on uh, Saturday? Um, actually, just watching film. We, I, we, didn't, we said to ourselves, we didn't realize we were on the field together. We didn't realize until we watched film. We were like, I didn't know you was in the game <laughs> until we, you know, watched film. But it was, it was fun. When you look at look at the pressure y'all were able to bring Saturday, was there anything different y'all were doing, or was it just a matter of getting home? Oh, it was just it was just a matter of getting home. The same old, same old. A few weeks while you were out, Don Terry obviously uh, having some real real nice games. What was it like to be able to watch him from the sideline and you know, see him sort of break out and become a, a big contributor on this defense? Um, it, it was a great experience to see my little brother just get out there and handle the business. And he's like I said, he's steady, he's steady growing each and every game. He's getting better. So once you get it down packed, uh, he'd be one of those. It seemed like there was a lot more front side pressure. You guys were getting in KJ's face and kind of you know forcing some early throws and things like that. You know, was that just part of the game plan or just one of those things that happened that's based on personnel? <clears throat> uh, I could say a little bit of both because we know what we was getting ourselves into, so we just had to go go in there and handle business. You got an over team who can run well inside, but they can also get two quarterbacks go outside at any time. How does the defense carry over from the Arkansas game and just put together another performance like that? I could just say just preparation through the week. I mean, nothing changing. We we know what we got. It's not like we faced some in the past before, so we just got to do it handle business. You and Demonte, Demonte, you and Dante both had the opportunity to go out of state and play college, but you elected to come here to Mississippi State. I mean, what are your thoughts about you know in-state players staying home for their college careers? I think it's, I think it's, for one, you plan for your own state. I mean, nothing like being home, playing for your home uh, home state, and just the fans, and it's already like the love here. I feel like if you go out of state, it's gonna be hard to regenerate unless you just, I guess, not say I'm not one of those guys, but unless you just be from the actual state to just get get a shot to play right away. Uh, just being here, man, this atmosphere is crazy. The family is it's all brotherly love and everything. Shout out from the training staff and the medical staff for getting you back out there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Shout out, shout out to them, man. You know, that was just hard work and dedication. Yeah, I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> when, you heard, when you heard that Mookie got SEC to this player of the week, what did you tell him? Oh, I, already, I already told him. I said, yeah, you, you – before they even announced that, I said, yeah, you were crazy. But uh, congratulations to you, my, my dog. You know, that's like a brother on and off the field. Um, he already he deserved it. So, asking the coaches about it, what do you remember from uh, the last trip to Auburn a couple of years ago with the, the the big comeback and the way the defense was able to, to dig in there? Yeah, we know that uh, that the atmosphere there is going to be crazy. It's one, you know, just one of those teams that we can't just really sleep on, and we you know we just go in there and just with our, our, our hard head and lunchbox ready to play. So.